Good morning from the Roast and Rest Shelter. Nice little spot right here. It's a good company last night, this morning. I just heard that uh, some of the southern states got hit with some really bad flooding down in Virginia, North Carolina, uh, around Damascus and Asheville. I know that's rough, guys. I'll be praying for y'all. Got about five more miles till the Long Trail meets up with the Appalachian Trail. Been a wild ride. This trail is everything I imagined. It's still the Long Trail until we get to the Massachusetts border, but I've already done that section a couple times, a few times now. But north of the junction, the trail is significantly different. Let's get it. Last shelter exclusive to the LT, Tucker John. Stayed here on the way north. It's a nice little spot. I feel really bad for all the people in the south struggling with the flooding and all the hurricane devastation. It's a real bummer. I'm not sure what it's gonna mean for my hike when I get down there. I guess I'll just have to wait and see. Take whatever detours I need to. But right now, I just hope that everybody's getting, you know, Getting what they need, food, water. Sounds like a horrible situation.
back on the AT. Crazy how much everything changed right after hitting the junction. Everything's green. seen a comment that said you could wait for the free bus by the Killington sign. It's supposed to pass every 20 minutes after the hour. Give it a whirl. Guy in the Jeep just brought me in. I don't know if the bus was coming or not, but that was better than waiting. Waiting on the bus. Should be one more pass back towards Rutland. Drop me off at the uh, Long Trail Inn. I camp across the street again. Should be coming any minute now. Thank you. I hate crossing this road right here. It's like right on top of a hill, so you can't really see what's coming either way. Oops. 